Welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics. So students today I am going to show you a mind blowing trick with which you will be able to divide any number by 9 in literally orally. Instantly you will be able to do it. Okay. And the trick goes like this when you have a number you will looking at that number you will be able to tell what is its quotient, what is its remainder. Okay. So the first thing what you should do is whatever is your first number now you will write it as it is and then you will add this one to the next number which is 2 so the answer is 3 and then you add this 3 to the next number or the last number which is 3 plus 4 which is going to get you 7 now this number after 4 there is no number so the last number addition whatever you get that becomes your remainder and 13 becomes your quotient okay if you want we can just have a look at this 1 2 4 divide by 9 so this is 1 za. when this is taken away you are getting 3 4 right so this is 13 za. so 3 is 27 and when you take 27 from 34 you are left with 7 right you saw your 7 is your remainder and 13 is your quotient okay and that is how you got this okay students if you are liking the way i'm explaining then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos also don't forget at the end of this video i'm going to put up a diy question whose answers you can mention in the comment section okay so now for this one we first we write the first number as it is so 6 then 6 plus 0 is again 6 then 6 plus 1 is 7 and 7 will be your remainder and this is your quotient okay so now see this i'm sure you must be wondering that for every uh, uh, both of these uh, examples have a remainder what happens when there is no remainder okay so what happens in that case is so we have 1 we'll write as it is 1 plus 4 we'll write 5 and 5 plus 4 is 9 okay so now please understand when you have a remainder which is 9 or greater than 9 then what you have to do is you just subtract this 9 by 9 so here your remainder comes out to be 0 and since you subtracted 9 over here here you will add 1 so your final answer will be just quotient of 16 for this particular division okay so now the next one i'm sure you must be wondering by now that what happens in case of carry okay so here this is an example where there will be a case of carry okay so again 5 we'll write as it is 5 plus 1 is 6 6 plus 2 is 8 and 8 plus 3 is 11 now see please understand your remainder whenever you are dividing by 9 obviously your remainder has to be lesser than 9 if it is greater than 9 then you will subtract by 9 and whatever answer you get the answer you get in this case is 2 so that becomes your remainder and since you are subtracting by 9 once so you will add 1 to your quotient so your quotient now becomes 5 6 9 okay i hope you all have understood the hack or rather the trick how to do this okay all the particular scenarios have been now covered okay so now very quickly let's do for this one so we have 1 3 6 then 10 and 15 subtract 9 so you will be left with what 6 so now understand when you write this you actually write this this way and 1 gets added over here right because of this 9 okay so this will be what 10 plus 1 is 11 so you just write 1 over here and the other one will get carried to the next number so 6 plus 1 will be 7 3 1 so this is your quotient and this is your remainder okay so now very quickly right let's write for this one so we have 1 we have 2 we have 5 now let's write this 5 plus 9 is 14 so we we'll write 4 and 1 on top of 5 okay 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 5 is how much 11 
so we'll write 11 on the other side sorry after 14 we are adding 2 to it so we get 16 so again the 1 will, will be written on top of 4 and 16 plus 5 will get you 21 so we will have 21 as your remainder but now please understand if you look closely 9 if you subtract from 21 still you will get a number which is greater than 9 so check for 18 if you subtract from 18 the remainder you are getting is 3 okay so now please understand in this case the remainder is 3 whenever whenever you get the remainder which is greater than 9 you have to check if it is greater than 18 or 27 you know in 9's table okay so now here how much you're going to add you are going to add 2 because 9 2's are 18 right so your final answer in your quotient will now be 2 1 plus 4 is 5 1 plus 6, 5 is 6 2 and 1 okay so you saw how easily you could do these kind of questions okay so students those of you who have not subscribed please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel because that really means a lot to me and also also hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i push up a new video also students i have other tricks when uh, for similar tricks when it comes to dividing by 13 and 19 so if you want uh, then i can make a separate video on that as well okay and if you want to divide by 13 and 19 like with all the div uh, decimals and properly not just quotient and remainder then the those videos are already been made and the link of that will be available somewhere on top as well as in the description okay so now <coughs> one last minute just let's quickly revise this whenever you have whenever you divide anything by 9 you write the first number as it is and then you add the succeeding numbers to the quotient number whichever we are getting over here in case you get a number which is higher then what you do in that case is you write the tens part on the previous number and just write the units parts over here just as we wrote for 14 for 16 okay similarly if your remainder has a number which is 9 or greater than 9 then in that case you subtract 9 and whatever answer you get is your final remainder if you are subtracting by 9 you will add 1 to your quotient if you are subtracting by 18 you will add 2 to your quotient okay so now time for your DIY do let me know what is the answer of 2 1 5 divided by 9 do let me know your answers in the comment section so that's it for today i will see you in the next video